Well, hello everyone, I'm back from the Penske truck. Guess where I'm going? Oh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> I got a big boy and the trailer with the electric car on it. Got the family up in front in the SUV with kids and uh, getting out of Florida. About three hours in right now leaving one of the most beautiful beaches uh, probably in the world uh, Gulf of Mexico Gulf Boulevard Reddington Beach Reddington Shores Indian Rocks uh, Madeira Beach it just treasure islands it just goes on and on it's kind of like Las Vegas Strip so instead of casinos you get the most beautiful uh, beaches where uh, water is sometimes just green and it's that beautiful green not like filthy dark green or something and uh, white sand just amazing it's close to st petersburg so if anybody is uh, ever interested uh, of going in uh, i'm leaving so you won't see me there <laughs> yeah i decided to invest in farmland um, up north a little bit about 15 hours from florida driving I decided uh, to make that move about two years ago but could not uh, really pull the trigger on the proper property that we uh, really liked and finally it all worked out and uh, now um, that's it I'm on my way here you go yeah I believe uh, farmland is going to be very expensive in years to come uh, definitely in this decade you guys know that follow my blog I believe gold silver platinum palladium rhodium all precious metals especially gold silver and platinum have a lot of room still to go up uh, so it's not just a store of wealth it's also right now uh, a really good speculative investment because this thing can just blow up we're talking a possibility of twenty thousand dollar an ounce of gold um, we hear a lot of stories about a lot of cases for 15k gold an ounce I don't care of course I would want it to to see it in in those numbers I only care to make sure that is in my possession okay what can I get for an ounce of gold not how much is really worth in the dollars so uh, one of the uh, most um, steady store of wealth gold you look at uh, silver that's a lot more volatile that's why I like it because uh, you just never know with silver how far up you can go for right now which is uh, trading uh, sorry spot price is about 28 27 dollars an ounce um, this is not even close to the all-time high for silver we still got about 25 more to go 25 more dollars just to get to the all-time high so gold's already passed it so I'm already looking at silver is my big uh, big play here as well as platinum and the reason I like platinum a lot is 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 about the same as silver a lot more room to go platinum was about 2200 an ounce for the all-time high I believe in 2011 and right now it's trading about the mid 900s so platinum to me is a big play as well but you got to have gold first if you have a little bit of gold great uh, gold stocks silver stocks those are all uh, fun to speculate in uh, I believe there is tremendous opportunity here to have a 10 bagger meaning uh, a dollar stock can be a ten dollar stock pretty quickly here and that is going to happen it's just a matter of time so you guys don't have to listen to me what I'm doing I'm just telling you how I am preparing for the upcoming crash which I believe is going to happen right after the election uh, we're going to have at least 80% of sell-off. It can even be 90% or greater in the equities. So right after the election, a huge market drop. Right now, it's going to be a melt-up. Uh, we can we can see S&P 500 go to 4,500 before that big uh, haircut takes takes place. So that's how I'm positioning myself so to close it off real quick to keep a short video here while I'm while I'm driving before I do something stupid here 
farmlands, gold, silver, and I believe energy stocks after the meltdown when, um, when, when it happens next year, when the big sell-off happens, I believe energy stocks have great, great opportunity here to go to, to prices that nobody knows where it's going to go. So that's how I'm going to play this market, that this is what I'm doing. You guys do whatever uh, you think it's best for you and your family. God bless you all, and uh, you'll see more videos from the farmland. Take care.